Joining me now is the unbeaten David Benavidez. Congratulations, 21st knockout. You're a bad man. Uh, how would you rate your performance tonight? I mean, I rate it pretty good, but I know I could have did better, man. Uh, Ronald Ellis was a tough, tough competitor, man, and um, I just I just hope the fans like what they've seen. You know, I do a lot of combinations, punches and bunches. That's what they like to see, so I hope they had a good show tonight. Was he tougher than you thought he was going to be? Yeah, he was definitely tougher than I thought he was going to be, but, um, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. Sometimes the one you think you're going to stop early, you stop until late. You know what I mean? So my uh, hats off to Ronald Ellis. Him and his team, they're all gentlemen. So, you know, uh, hats off to them again. What do you think your performance tonight said to the 168-pound division? Well, you know, I want all the big guys, you know, and I feel like uh, speaking for the fans, too, they would love to see me with all the big guys because, as you can see, you know, I love throwing punches. I love stopping people. So uh, me against all the big names would be an amazing fight. Um, you know, Charlo, Caleb, Plant, Canelo, all of them. I'm, I'm, I'm willing to fight all of them. And you've made it no secret that you said next you would like Jamal Charlo. Uh, what would be the incentive for Jamal Charlo to come up to 168 to fight you? Well, I mean, he was talking about me, saying he can knock me out, so if it's that easy, come do it, man. You know what I mean? I feel like it makes sense for the company, for me and him. We both need that next step up, you know, to get into bigger and better things, so I feel like it makes sense for both parts. Uh, and what, so what is next for David Benavidez? It, realistically, when do you see yourself fighting again and, and against who? You know, whoever, I'm, I'm willing to fight, you know, in August or September, whoever they, they want me to fight against, you know, I'm willing to fight whoever. I mean, it doesn't matter right now. I've been professional eight years. I want some excitement. I want the big names, whoever. Come on, come on. You know, one guy that you guys have had, it seems like four years now, is Caleb Plant. Yeah. When do we think we'll see a David Benavides Caleb Plant well, Whenever fight? he grows some balls, I'm ready right now. But let's see if he, he's not, I don't think he's ready right now. So whenever he wants to fight me, I'm right here standing. And, of course, everybody in this division wants Canelo Alvarez. You said, hey, look, I need to earn that fight. If you guys fought right now, do you think David Benavides could take Can Canelo Alvarez? I definitely feel like I'd beat Canelo Alvarez. And I feel like it would right be, now. Uh, right now, I'd beat Canelo Alvarez. And I feel like it would be a great fight for the fans, too. At the end of the day, people want to see great fights and fireworks, and that's what I give. Yeah. And how long we see we see David Benavides at 168? I mean, I'm, I was on weight the whole week. You know what I mean? This was the first time I've been on weight the whole week. You know, so I just relaxed. So with the diet, you know, uh, the diet that I had and going back to Big Bear, I could stay at 168 for three more years. Yeah. Uh, and and you do you see yourself continuing this training in Big Bear or do you go back now with COVID winding down do you go back training at your home gym or what? No definitely I feel like you know at, at the end of the day you know all my fans deserve uh, I deserve to give my fans 110 percent of myself every time I step into the training camp and Big Bear is that sweet spot for me so I'm gonna keep going back there until my career finishes. All right David Benavidez that was really impressive tonight congratulations yeah. on the victory. Thank you brother and thank you I want to I want to thank all the fans for all the love and support thank you so much. David Benavidez, he remains unbeaten. David, best luck. Look forward to seeing you in the future. Thank you.